Greetings, friends. I hope you're well. Today, I'd like to talk to you about uh, a few moments of faith. Uh, looking at life, our ups and downs, our happiness, our sorrows, our heartaches and heartbreaks, kindness and cruelty, broken promises and unrealized dreams. We fall backwards, yet somehow we move forward in life. We grow up, we grow old. And with reflection and prayerfully, we find satisfaction. So, you know, uh, I was recently contacted by uh, someone and, and asked, what is in the book? What is Faith, Flag, and Family all about? So today I, I thought I would uh, delve into that and uh, provide you an excerpt from one of the essays that are contained within Faith, Flag, and Family. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you would, please. And thanks so much for your support. page 179 I wrote, I worry that when my earthly time is over, I will only be remembered by the closest of family. Given a few years, that memory too shall fade. My concern is that perhaps I squandered opportunities to make a lasting impression on the lives of many. There are those who might believe I may desire fame or fortune, perhaps even celebrity. These are but mere material things, which, as with age, also diminish. A dear friend once told me, a person's good name is worth more than precious jewels. I believe that money, fame, and material items are fleeting. I ask you to join me in considering a thought that often occupies my mind. Are you happy in life having less? If you're happy with less stuff, perhaps you hold considerable spiritual wealth. I have known others who were wealthy, yet unhappy, who focused their desires on material items expensive and ostentatious, and of course, in the real sense, hold little value. As I plan for my later years, I am committed to giving more of myself in the service of others. I am confident that I will know nothing of fortune, of fame, and of celebrity. I am convinced that there shall be no windfall, no social step up. I am positive that my life will be simple and likely best described as ordinary. Yet I am poised to offer the best in me in the service of others, benefiting lives I shall not count nor know, yet I trust to one day think of the man who gave of himself to benefit those unbeknownst to him. I hope you enjoyed this video presentation and I, I do hope you uh, enjoy Faith, Flag and Family, a purposeful guide for selfless service. And don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much and God bless.